All right, well, up next, we're not making any mistakes. We're going to be heading over to the cooking corner where it's all about Shalom Fest. We're making one of the most popular snacks in Israel and a vegetable salad. Stay with us. Welcome back. It's time to celebrate Jewish food, music, and culture. It's Shalom Fest, and it's happening this weekend. Itzik Levin, the food service coordinator for Shalom Fest, and Mark Lobo from the Israel Exhibit and Temple, uh, are, they're both joining us to tell us more about not only the food, but the festival, uh, the festival that's going to be attracting a lot of people, especially since there's food involved. And one of the things we're going to do is talk to Itzik about what He's making, and this looks really good. It smells really good too, by the way. I'm frying falafel. It's one of the most popular um, dish in the Middle East. It's a vegetarian, made of garbanzo beans. Garbanzo cilantro, beans. Cilantro, garlic, uh, parsley, and some other uh, uh, spices. And then you just kind of press it together? This press is just- Press together. I have a special tool that I brought with me uh -huh. from Israel. Wow, and so the prep time, as far as putting all of this together, you, do you need water? Do you need oil? What do you need? Frying oil. Frying oil, okay. And fry it for a few minutes and then uh, pull them out for a nice bowl with high fiber. <laughs> high fiber, lots of fiber. How and long are they supposed to fry? And obviously this is not for a, a few traditional minutes. skillet, correct? No. Okay. On so the Shalom Fest we're going to have um, a big uh, skillet and uh, we'll have actually a couple people going to do it. Ooh. We're going to make uh, a few thousand of those. A few thousand? <laughs> Yeah. That means a lot of people are expected for this event, correct? I hope so. Oh, yeah. Wow. <laughs> now, very quickly, you were um, t telling me a little bit about some of the food that's here. That's also, okay. all of this food is vegetarian. That's right, except the uh, chopped liver. Okay. And uh, what we have on the bakery item, we have macaroons. It's from, made from coconut. Okay. We have, and those uh, are the pastries that we're talking exactly. about. Exactly. Yeah, okay. There are the pastries the, uh, right there. Rugalach, Amentash. Uh-huh. Um, and we have some, a few more items, they're not here at okay. the moment, so people have to come over and, and, uh, um, and buy them. Oh, and, and so when people actually taste the food, have you uh, had the surprise reaction from people thinking, oh, you know, it, it, like, some folks are not, we're not raised vegetarians, so it's definitely an exposure that some people are not Absolutely. familiar Absolutely. People yeah. uh, like it. Uh, it's all homemade, so we don't homemade. make anything from boxes or anything. Right, right. Actually, it takes me three days just to make the mix for oh. the falafel. Wow. And um, so we have the, the complete dish here. Uh-huh. It's the falafel ball. We have a hummus, again, made okay. from garbanzo beans. We have yes. tahini sauce. Uh -huh. It's made from uh, sesame seeds. And we have an uh, Israeli um, salad, which is a fresh uh, vegetables. And finally, cut. And the dressing made of olive oil and uh, lemon juice. Oh, it sounds so good. OK, mm -hmm. now I have to turn things over to Mark. <laughs> Mark, you're handling everything entertainment-wise, everything outside of food. So what can people expect when they come to the Shalom Fest? Well, there'll be uh, entertainment uh, running all day. And um, uh, we're going to include uh, the uh, Temple Israel house band, the uh -huh. Levites. They uh -huh. play a variety of everything from popular Israeli music to ritual type music with a modern twist. Oh, uh, wow. Rebecca Ungerman, a, uh -huh. a storied jazz singer in Tulsa, is going to be one of the performers. Mm -hmm. uh, we're also going to have in the building, we're going to have demonstrations of a uh, Jewish wedding, a bar mitzvah, uh -huh. and there's also going to be a, a demonstration of the Torah, which is our scroll of, uh, uh, that uh, is the, you know, kind of the basis of, uh, of Jewish uh, beliefs. So mm -hmm. um, it's going to be running all day. Uh, we're going to have tours of the temple, which is a good time to learn about the facility and learn a little bit about uh, Judaism. And very exciting for a lot of people who are not familiar. Thank you both for coming. And once again, the Shalom Fest, uh, there it is. The information is there on your screen. Sunday, this Sunday, going on from 12 to 6 o'clock, Temple Israel. And of course, if you want more information, shalomfest.com is where you can find it. Thank you so okay. much for joining us. Thank you. All right. Well, they're not.